A rare site was on display last night during a brush fire in Chula Vista. The San Diego Fire Department did nighttime water drops. New at 7 o'clock, 10 News anchor Derek Stahl looks at the technology allowing it to happen. It's a site Chula Vista firefighters aren't used to. Drop after drop of aerial support at night. It made a big difference. Only two helicopters in all of San Diego County are capable of firefighting at night, and both were hard at work around 11 o'clock Wednesday, keeping this fire at four acres. The helicopters are operated by the San Diego Fire Rescue Department. There's always a concern at night because of the unknown, what you can't see. For decades, nighttime water drops were unheard of. Cal Fire still doesn't do them, but it's catching on thanks to advances in night vision technology. These night vision goggles intensify light 6,000 times, allowing pilots to see obstacles a little more clearly. The tricky part is that they narrow your field of view. It's almost like looking down a paper tube. Uh, your sense of, of uh, movement, is, is less, you, you, you tend to have to scan more. This, we have what we Firefighters call change their strategy at night, filling up their water tanks while landed on the ground rather than while hovering in the air. As you're hover filling, uh, water can come up on the windscreen, obstructing the view of the pilot. So the safest operation is to land on the ground and fill um, the uh, water tank on the ground. It's one of the tricks San Diego Fire has learned since they started doing night drops in 2005. They expanded their coverage countywide in 2014. We take a lot more precaution at night. We're very careful in how we do things. We plan things out very well. We have uh, checklists and, and things like that that we go through that before we even leave uh, to ensure our safety. Derek Stahl, 10 News. Cal Fire recently purchased some Firehawk helicopters for night flying. The agency says it hopes to roll that out about the first of the month. Chris